Hey guys, welcome back. We're taking another first look at Buck Colony. It is a early access indie robot voice control game. It was made in 2014, believe it or not. Uh, it's quite diverse. Um, right now we're acting like the spy that broke in. Um, and I, I really don't know. I haven't played too much of, well, past the tutorial part, but there's a robot inside. Uh, well, I'm gonna show you uh, here in a second. Um, but we can pretty much control it um, by that tablet over there on the table. Usually, you'll be able to communicate with Nakagawa robots face to face. Your tablet now. Try exiting the tablet interface. Okay, so this is a robot we're gonna be speaking to today. Um, kind of. Uh, Showing you what he can do and a little bit of story and you can return to the general tablet gameplay at any time. So we're just gonna walk over here. Can't really pass the water uh, that's kind of surrounding this place. So I want to go inside now to communicate with the okay, robot. So this is robot. Enter and start Again. speaking. So we can Review speak the text using the our microphone, Edit it if or in his type it in. Send it. If you prefer, you can type. Introduce yourself to the robot. So, in the gameplay here, I am uh, kind of using my mic, but I kind of muted my mic, so I can put a voiceover. Um, but the voice recognition doesn't really work all that great sometimes it does uh, depending oh, what type of mic you have how close or far away you are Hello, Bob. there's a lot of variations I guess Jimmy. congratulations you have just made contact with the Nakagawa remember that ask what are your commands so there's many commands you can be you can pretty much teach him how to do a lot of things such as looking at pictures open doors and sitting down things like that I know some um, manipulation commands some he's gonna show you now commands, I'll tell you now communication commands For okay example, so there you go my manipulation oh. command of pull rotate swap close put drop pick up align push replace and open there we go. So, robots you can remember any fact you tell well, them. Okay, hold on. Ask the robot what your name is. Okay, so um, what I was gonna say is um, I am a robot. During the gameplay, um, you can pretty much ask him anything uh, related to. The break in because during the uh, the, tor uh, the tutorial, press um, F10 to open the dialogue history. Scroll using the thumb well. door. <laughs> Your first mission is to discover what happened in the 48 hours leading up to the break in. If you ask a question about something Jimmy saw, he may show you a video from his memory. Okay, so there's also videos you can mission, show you, you need and to you need all 14 the chip was in the house to and complete why the, family the wasn't tutorial. Home when the spy arrived. For a perfect but score, you need to see all 14 of Jimmy's videos. Then you will be able to piece together exactly what happened. Yes, I read that. If you've completed that, the investigation mission, page up skips to the clue removal mission. First, find out who lives in the house. You can ask Jimmy as many questions as you She like. likes to talk a lot. When you're ready to move and on to the next skip investigation <laughs> technique, press page down. Nakagawa and we're robots gonna, will we're obey skip direct orders from humans. Okay, there we go. Um, we skipped all that dialogue, and now there's a briefcase down on well, in the master bedroom. Uh, I don't understand on the floor. what you mean by here. I was I was meaning to come to me, but I'm actually the wall, so um, yeah. But once he gets in here, um, uh, 
Did you mean go to the dam room? So I told the or oh, Jimmy to go Miyama room, which uh, the family that was here is Chinese, and you can kind of see. Well, there's a few pictures you can go through. Well, I only have one, but there'll be a few. Now there's this clock here, which was on the table. Now, you can zoom in and out as you need, but I must, well, in this gameplay, I tried to make the robot open or attempt to open the briefcase. Now you can ask the robot to uh, log on the computer, pretty much, and maybe get some information that way too. I'm not sure now about here, the answer, here might but it may ask, be interesting um, for you to know if I want to see like a video, kind of, of that time. And, uh... Yeah, the, f the voice recognition isn't all that great, as I said. Um... A lot depending on different variations like your mic and stuff like that yeah it just kind of depends <laughs> even your voice kind of uh, will mess with it too so yeah I was trying to see if I can see the robot um, there's this uh, here which you can see kind of some of the times which can help you uh, complete the tutorial the tutorial it's uh, kind of tricky when you don't know what you're doing well, at least when you're starting out I'm pretty sure there's enough videos on YouTube that you can search and find everything you need but I think it took me at least three to four hours kind of to complete the tutorial because I had no idea what's going on yeah it was uh, <laughs> quite a time to figure all that out but yeah guys um, this game's on Steam if you want to go get it it's kind of a game you want you want you just want to check out, but I don't think well it's good and it's challenging. The challenging part will be like uh, you're like a um, detective in a way, and you got to see what happened at, well in the house. Uh, and I didn't know there's a part over there too that <laughs> um, yeah I didn't see that part over there that little guest house or whatever it is I never seen that I was I was free almost forgot to mention um, you can pretty much ask him anything if you want to um, he might not respond as you might think uh, he can open I might have said that already don't know <laughs> um, but I've been enjoying this game. Uh, I didn't put no review on Steam yet, but it runs good. Well, of course, but <laughs> um, I give the overall gameplay. Uh, I would say an eight, an eight, because well. It doesn't give you much of, well, help, I would say, or hints. But it does guide, kind of guide you guys through the process. But yeah, guys, I'll see you guys next time.